Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your um, March mid, your mid March 2018 reading. Guys, I've done so many readings today, so um, this is the last one, so it'll be the best one. Save the best for last. All right, Taurus, so I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera. We'll give the cards a quick shuffle and then we'll get started, all right? Some of you could be dealing with a Sagittarius or you're needed to balance out your emotions. Uh, four of Pentacles. Some of you are really guarded. Uh, maybe due to, to the fact that the lovers is here. You could be dealing with Gemini or there might need to be a choice made between lovers. Either you're making a choice or, or uh, a partner is. This could be someone you've got time with. You, you've built a life with, with the ten of pentacles um the hierophant there is you I'm trying to be spiritual about this but knowing that you need to make a decision you're engaging in prayer meditation taking a rest from either the person or the situation or the relationship Right, because someone is being sneaky, a liar. Here's the other woman here, um, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Or, or there's a, that's your partner. Two of Wands, you have to make a, a decision. Which way are you going to go with this? You're going to lay the burden down that is a love affair. Or just a situation that no longer serves you or right because the three of Pentacles is here six of wands king of wands then the queen of wands yeah this is a long standing relationship um, yeah this is a long standing relationship someone's trying to build elsewhere and have victory elsewhere And that's why you're you're guarded. You understand that you know what's going on. This person thinks that they're doing it sneakingly or, or behind your back. But you understand what's going on, right? The hermit. You've gone within about this us. Uh, you've gone within. you you you're having some nostalgic thoughts about the situation. The situation, it might involve children, um, and maybe that's why there's some hesitation, inconsistency, to, just to make the decision to walk away from something that no longer serves you, because there's children involved. You could be dealing with a Virgo. You're being very close with them. You need to make a decision uh, surrounding home and in your relationship, um, your marriage or long-standing relationship. Um, you're trying to make a decision about it. You're engaging in prayer and meditation. You've even taken a step back from it. But you're also still being very sneaky, too. Um, this could be Taurus. This could be someone doing this to Taurus. Uh, but someone needs to chart a new path, lay down burden, because you might be trying to build or get recognition. Or you may be getting recognition, promotion, or success in your business. But the home life is a little fuzzy. Mm. See if we can get another spread for our tourists in love. Oh wow. It's just like everybody is just like clearing. I guess it's just the energy right now. Alright, thank you, thank you, thank you for the messages. 
The messages for Taurus. Messages in love for Taurus. High Priestess, Queen of Swords. Some of you are really relying on your intuition in regards to maybe an air sign, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Because there is a lot of unknown here. Maybe some secrets and some lies surrounding a child or children. Maybe someone has a child or children or there's something or, or their past is resurfacing. But the tower is here saying the universe will come in, help you um, break down this foundation, shift the energy. All right. King of sword, King of Wands, once again. Uh, some of you could be dealing with the air sign or fire sign. All of this energy takes you to the hangman status where you're not doing anything. Someone is offering their cup. I'm hearing it's like too little, too late. Too little, too late. And um, it, it just doesn't reciprocate. Maybe because someone, wow. Yeah. Third party, seven of swords, three of pentacles, three of, of cups. Someone's out here dating, acting single, being sneaky, actually being in an actual physical love affair. Someone's walking away emotionally, choosing a new path. This could be you, Taurus. Definitely you. You're standing your ground on this. You're very guarded. You want success elsewhere. And it looks like you'll have it. Um, there's a little indecision. But you know you need to make a decision surrounding the fact that your partner has someone else in this relationship. You might even have someone else, Taurus, or vice versa. Messages of love are here. In which, it's like your partner keeps trying to keep their relationship alive just a bit. So that you don't just completely walk away. So they get messages of love, page of cups. That makes you confused but they really have you in some third party bs you're not happy you want happiness a solid happy home life um someone who is uh, loving open honest you're trying to have strength and moving forward so that you can have that you can take your life and your um relationships to the next level you might even be um separated from this person or just not talking not engaging you feel stuck at times because of the betrayal this is a very dominating person this could be you Taurus or an Aries you do have the king and queen of wands messages of stability are, are here for you it might be elsewhere the sun will come out and illuminate things for you because you're in the dark with the moon You've been through a lot in this situation. You might need to close the door completely with the world. Close, wrap up a chapter. You've gone as far as you can go here. Have the divorce, the separation. Practice caution in relationship due to de jealousy, infidelity, unfaithfulness. Stop harping on the fact that you put in so much time and effort. Come out of expectancy because I don't think it's, it's going to happen for you here. Move forward. And victory effortlessly by yourself. The chariot carries one. Move away from turbulence. Go to a more calm and placid state. You might be doing this rather quickly. You could be moving. There'll be a new passionate start for self. The nine of pentacles. Because you're tied up the love affair. Either that you are engaging in tours. Like you're initiating it. Or vice versa. Uh, you're tired of the arguing, the biting. You are not willing to put the work into it. You want the situation to just end or die or either transform. Some of you want it to end. Um, you're ready and willing. Look how she looks away from the reading. Ready and willing to give love elsewhere and be like the fool and start over. Have good energy. Have karmic energy return to you. Have the will turn in your favor and enact some justice for you because you felt like things were unfair in the past that brought you to the nine of swords anxiety anxiousness 
sleepless and restless nights, but now healing is here. And you can offer what you have to offer, something stable, suitable, grounded to someone else or someone offering this to you. It, it will take a while, but you'll get there. And maybe you'll be like the King of Swords, or maybe the King of Swords is offering something stable and grounded to you. Could be an Aquarius, um, a, a start of new love or a resurgence of love or, or friendship. To you, Taurus, this is typically for me, the Virgo Taurus. To you, Taurus, the Empress, the Abundant One, the Creationist. Um, but you're going to have to cut something or someone out you're gonna be very stern with your words this is a a message this isn't a, a monologue this isn't a four-page letter this is being very short to the point about being done because uh, some truth may come out that shifts the energy and allows you to see things differently maybe around a gemini libra aquarius so that type of truth it only takes you to the next step, which is action. Um, a message of action, page of wands is here. Uh, it might be just that you just need to lay down the burden. That is this relationship. You have the manifestation powers to manifest a loving and reciprocating mutual relationship. Or you need to make a final decision about a relationship that you're already half in and half out. Maybe with a Knight of Wands, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. They rush in, they rush out. This is a person that comes in, out of, in and out of your life. Nine of Cups. You may be hoping and wishing to just walk away. Lay down the partnership. Lay down the relationship. Take to no offer cut someone completely out just grieve the process and the loss of the relationship and the fact that someone was you know uh, dishonest there was infidelity there was no choice made go within restore yourself find balance within yourself be introspective and which will bring you some real peace some peace and temperance You'll get back emotion, emotionally balanced. All right. Okay. I mean, that was pretty. That was pretty good, Taurus. I mean, like, I really feel like somebody is trying, but it's like a half-ass try, and it's like way too late. You know. Um. It looks like you're gonna. You might just need to leave behind partnership and move forward by yourself. Let's see if I can get messages of. Uh, Career and finance for tours. Messages of career and finance for tours. Career and finance for tours. Career finance for tours. Career finance for tours. Career and finance for tours. Ten of spades. All right. So there might be some betrayal. The ultimate level of backstabbing. Um, someone uh, blindsiding you. Maybe in your career and finance. Uh, going behind your back and uh, seven of diamond but there'll be good news uh, ba maybe baby news um, there'll be the anticipation of money and it's coming in nine of spades uh, you, you've got money coming in but you, you, you're still thinking negatively about it um, two of spades you gotta make a decision You're trying to rest on your uh, psychic abilities with the seven of clubs here. Also, you're being a little defensive. Uh, six of spades. You're definitely dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're trying to just lay down the burden. Make achievements over these small burdens that may be another person. Get into a more placid and calm time because you're expecting... A large sum of money I think it'll bring you balance and stability uh, or you're guarded here against once again uh, Aries Sagittarius and Leo there'll be some wish fulfillment here 
whatever you're hoping and wishing for if it's this money king of cups cancer pisces scorpio then it comes to you wow ace of diamond nice it, it, it gets you back emotionally stable this money wow then a ten of, of hearts yeah the ultimate level of happiness with uh, maybe solidifying a business partnership a new start of a business getting a new home getting a large sum of money uh, solidifying a relationship taking it to the next level uh once again a large payout you're anticipating this with the seven of diamond wow success in business health in your business what did i say nice 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 eight of hearts now visitors in your home being invited to an event nice eight of spades but sometimes still feeling trapped to negativity past her past situations the four of club is here saying that uh, uh unforeseen unexpected bad event comes in maybe surrounding jack of clubs aries sagittarius and leo where you have to do verbal battle with them there'll be reversal and cancellation they take you back maybe even with an air sign gemini libra aquarius seven of spades you need to lay down the burden that is the friendship with this person friendship meaning romantic friendship business partnership lay down the burden that is this person they are sneaky they're a liar they're cheap they're out for self here to be a gemini libra or aquarius we've got libra and aquarius here all right chart a new path here um and it looks like you'll have the opportunity to do so because there's money coming in um something solid coming in it brings you to the ultimate level of happiness it could be surrounding a water sign if not it just brings you um emotional fulfillment and stability all right leave those the air sign and that damn fire sign leave them where they are honey until they get it right because they are all wrong Let's get some additional guidance for you. And then we're out of here. All right. What's the additional guidance for Taurus? Messages of support for Taurus. Messages of support for Taurus. All right. All right. Here we go. Messages of support, additional messages of support. Oh, wow, support. You have support. There are supportive people around you. There are organizations that will support you. Uh, the Six of Diamond did come out. If you need charity in any type of way, support is here. Family members, emotions. Yeah, it looks like um, someone is trying to play on your emotions. It's like they come in and they offer, like I said, that page of cups, they offer um emotion here and there just to keep you on the string but you know it's not real it's not grounded or rooted in anything solid it's just so that you can still be there wherever there is for them they want you there um take the next step now and if that's walking away if that's solidifying your life in a different manner with that two of wands then do so keep the faith things will turn out in the manner that they're supposed to uh, stay in prayer, meditation, memories. Yeah, the Six of Cups. Keep having memories. Windfall with that Four of Diamond, that Seven of Diamond, um, the Ace of Diamond. Could be a windfall of good luck, money, something positive coming in. Spiritual growth. Nice. Some of you are spiritually growing, or you need to engage in spiritual growth, especially with Keep the Faith. And at the bottom of the deck, welcome the new. It's just all really good energy. Once you get past the stagnation of of those people in your life, maybe a fire sign or an air sign or whatever sign they may be, but you need to move past that. They keep you in in one place where you aren't able to take the next step. Um, understand that they're just there in and out. They're whimsical. You want something a lot more grounded. So choose to not engage. If you choose to not engage, you can welcome the new. And then what was under welcome and nice finances finances coming in nice 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 all right so taurus if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel 
request a personal reading. Take advantage of the $30 readings. Follow me on Instagram. My handles are below. Follow me on Instago. You can ask me a question or two there. I'll pull some cards for you and get an answer for you. Uh, choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link. Any donations are welcome. Any amount. Uh, get in contact with me via email to rowofl at gmail.com. You can request a personal reading. Um, I think that pretty much sums everything up. Remember, Taurus, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. I'll see you guys in April. Take care.